in this crochet tutorial you'll learn how to make this flower. This flower has like folded petals, so if you like it, please continue watching. To begin making this flower, we must chain 5. Now chain 3 and this will represent our first double crochet. Now we'll chain 5 more and uh, we will make a double crochet into this small loop. Now we'll turn our work We'll chain two and into this loop here we'll make eight. So I have 8 now and because this uh, 3 chain space here represent a 1 double crochet we will make 5 more double crochets in there. So it's 3, 4 and 5. So now, right here on our first double crochet, we will join these two with the corners with the slip stitch. So, all right. So our first petal is finished. Now we will make one more double crochet and then we will chain five. And then we will make one uh, more double crochet into this small loop here. So now we will turn our work chain 2 now in this 5 chain space we will make 8 double crochets Six, seven, and eight. So now we will turn our work into into this double crochet here. We will make five more double crochets. So now we will fold our paddle here and into this first double crochet in here we will insert our hook and make a slip stitch. So that completes our second paddle. 
You can make as many palettes as you want. You know, I only tried this with five or six, but maybe you can make more, I don't know. So anyways, for our third petal, we'll just repeat this process. We'll make one double crochet, then we'll chain five, and then we'll make one more double crochet. So now we will turn our work, chain two, and then make eight double crochets into this five chain space. Now that we made a double crochets, we will turn our work and then we'll make five more double crochets into this one double crochet in here. See? So now we'll join these two ends with the slip stitch. So we'll go into our first, into this double crochet here, and we'll just join this with a slip stitch. Now we have three petals finished. We're working on our fourth petal. So we will just repeat this process all the way. Now we have five petals, you can leave it this way, but I'm going to make one more, so... So we'll chain five, and then... Here, instead of making 
another double crochet. We are just going to go here one, two, one, two, three, four, five. So in here we will just after the five, fifth double crochet we will just join those two corners with a slip stitch. So now we will turn our work, chain two, and then make eight double crochets into this five chain space. So that's seven and then eight. Now we will turn our work and into this double crochet we will make five more double crochets. So that's our fifth double crochet. Now we are going to fold this paddle and then we will go into this space here and just join these two corners. With a slip stitch. I always chain one before I cut my flower. So now I'm just going to turn off the camera for a second and weave these ends in and then I'll come and show you the results. So this is how the flower looks after I weave the ends in. I hope this video tutorial was helpful and easy enough to follow. Thanks for watching.